Good evening, everyone. Officers are hitting the streets with a new piece of equipment built to keep you safer and the department more transparent. The Lebanon Police Department tested their brand new body cameras for the first time today. News Channel 5's Emily Luxon explains why officers believe the cameras are a smart investment in a story new at 10. Officers here at the Lebanon Police Department now have access to 100 body cameras. It was a process that took about two years, but officers think it will pay off for many more years to come. When Lebanon police officers head out on patrol, they are now armed with an additional crime fighting tool, body cameras. Like anything else, you start something new, there's a bit of a learning curve. After an officer clips on the camera, it will record any interaction they have with members of the public throughout the day. At the end of their shift, the video is uploaded to a server and stored for about a year. It's really simple to use. That was one of the criteria. We didn't want something that was going to be complicated. What's your name? Body cameras have been used by police departments across the mid-state to help fight crime, document officers' actions, and occasionally capture heart-stopping moments. Sergeant Hardy says Lebanon's almost $65,000 investment in the cameras will help the police department be more transparent. We may make a mistake, and the great thing about having the equipment is when that situation happens, we can review the footage, we can learn from it. In the end, Sergeant Hardy believes the cameras will make the community safer. It's just a, a, a great tool, like I said, to protect our citizens, to protect our officers, and to protect our city. If the police department here continues to grow, which is expected, officers say more body cameras could be added in the future. Reporting in Lebanon, Emily Luxon, News Channel 5. Thanks, Emily. As far as getting body cameras in the metro area, the police department and DA's office have said they need more money for them. The city has already set aside $15 million. The extra money would go to managing and monitoring all of that video.